All right, take two. It is Thursday. It's Veterans Day. Thank you to all the veterans. I am a third generation veteran. Both of my grandfathers served in World War II and my father served in Vietnam. I was in the Navy during the Kosovo conflict and the war that just ended. So, thank you to veterans. Yes. All right, so uh, we're sticking with the Thanksgiving theme. We had those uh, those candy corns last night that were tough to get through. Interesting, nonetheless. So I'm assuming everyone has had pumpkin pie. It is kind of the go-to Thanksgiving uh, holiday treat. And, uh, yeah, that's where the candy corn fucked up. Even though the apple pie was fine, who eats apple pie on Thanksgiving? I've seen it. No. But yeah, I mean... What is a what is a pumpkin? What is pumpkin? Uh, yeah, I guess I should want pumpkin. Pumpkin candy spice corn. fucking everything. You That's true. Get a pumpkin spice corn. In fact, I bet you they make one. They probably do. Okay. Well, write the good people at Barks or Brax or Brax. whatever the fuck they're called. All right. So. Do you know the heiress to the Brax fortune disappeared in the eighties and was declared dead after seven years and moved to like a hundred and forty-two million dollar estate that is still kicking off funds to animal welfare groups and helping the underprivileged children of Chicago? No idea. Okay. Now I know. I'll that on a murder podcast this week. Interesting. Hey. Well, <laughs> we're trying sweet potato pie tonight. So, I've never had sweet potato pie. I hear it's a southern thing. I'm from northern New Jersey. and But Suzanne is southern, and she never had it. Or you did have it, and you said you didn't really care for it. No, I didn't care for it. I have had it. It was always made by people, and I didn't like the texture. It just was grainy, and it didn't hold together the way a pumpkin pie did, and it just didn't have as much of that roasted whatever the fuck flavor. Okay. But Patty LaBelle may surprise us all. Yes, this is a Patty LaBelle uh, sweet potato pie. There's Patty right there. She knows her fucking pies. Literally. Yeah, I mean, I've seen the Sara Lee ones, but that you'd have to bake. It was a frozen one. This was at least fresh. Um, it did get the... First place, sweet potato pie from the American Pie Council. There's the blue ribbon right there. I didn't realize there was a pie council. The things you learn. So it says it's made with sweet potatoes. It's in 2019, though. I want to know what happened in 2020. Who fucking scooped it from them? I don't know. So they're, they're still you know hanging their hat on 2019. Maybe they didn't do it in 2020 because of corona. Maybe they're the reigning champion and we're just on a win of it. Uh, it is Call sweet potato pie. pie. Do it. Uh, made with sweet potatoes, butter, and spice. It says, uh, live with love, cook with soul. So, there you go. I don't know what the spices are, but it looks like it has the regular stuff. Sweet potato, that's the number one ingredient. That's important. Uh, corn syrup, water, butter, a bunch of other shit that I can't see. Soybean oil. Mm, hey. Okay. It also has instructions for heating this thing up. I am not a fan of fucking warm cream pies. That sounds disgusting. But if you did want to warm it up, you could throw it in the oven at 300 for about 15 minutes. Is it fully cooked? It is cooked. Okay. Yeah. There's no cooking on this thing. It just, you can eat it as it is. It That's says just for serving. that just baked flavor. Okay. If you want that. So we are going to break this open. Um, and we're going to see how this goes. So we'll be right back. Okay. It cut... You know, pretty much like a pumpkin pie. It actually held together pretty well. It didn't fall or, or, you know, fall apart or anything like that. I got a nice slice. Suzanne really wanted a smaller slice, so she wanted an eighth. I decided to go for a quarter. He went in and is having hey. 25% of the pie. Well, whatever. You know, it, go bigger than It does than look like it's got that texture that I was talking about where, you know, it doesn't... It's very orange. It's more orange than pumpkin pie is normally. You can smell the spices. Yeah, you definitely can. A lot of cinnamon. A lot. So I'm gonna take a bite. Hmm. Your texture's fucking weird. Yeah. It's not grainy. Like baby food. Like it's very sweet. Mushy. Oh, yeah, and it's got a ton of cinnamon. Ass ton of sugar. Ass ton so, of cinnamon. So I mean, maybe it's if it was home. Egg in there. Yeah. It's not you bad. You heated it up in the oven like the good I mean, woman told you to. It probably would have ran all over the fucking plate if you. No, it, it doesn't. That's not. Come on, man. That's not what would. <laughs> lies, lies. All right, so it's very sweet, um, but I guess pies are supposed to be sweet. It's not nearly as sweet as a pumpkin pie. Uh, all right, like a pumpkin pie is nowhere near as sweet as this. Correct. Yeah. So, and the texture is kind of like mashed sweet potatoes. Yeah, I'm getting like Texas Roadhouse fucking sweet potato with butter and sugar and cinnamon vibes. I don't. I like it. I think it's all right. Sure. I yeah. wouldn't. I would never choose it over pumpkin pie. Uh, no, I mean, I would probably just have one of each. 
you know, they're different, but they're similar. They're along the same lines. Yeah, why would you have one of each? Why not? I wouldn't make both. Okay. Well, you've never made this period, so that's really not a thing to be said. <laughs> so, um, okay. I mean, it's not bad. Take one. You're going to finish that slice, I'm assuming? Yeah, yeah. I don't dislike it. I just don't love it. Okay. I mean, it's not bad. Patty, you get a pass on this one. Patty knows that she can cake loves yeah. crust. Jesus. Ooh. Cake loves crust. That's body by crust. Look at this robust beast here. All right, so um, if you like sweet potatoes, you want to give it a whirl, go ahead and give it a try. Patty LaBelle, 2019 pie, yes. fucking pie I can't winner. I tell you if heating it up makes it better because somebody won't do it. It won't. I'm just putting that out there. So um, I'm going to put some whipped cream on this because I feel that all pies like this deserve a, a smattering of whipped cream. Maybe you just... should put mine in the, in the microwave. Do you want it in the microwave? Sure. Do you? Yes. Okay, well, I'm going to go new cur cream pie so it turns into a soupy fucking mess. And I'm gonna just eat mine as it is. So, all right. Um, I don't know. I mean, I I'm gonna give one of these. If I was at a, if I was at a, an event and this was a dessert option, depending on what else there was, I may or may not have a piece. I don't like that. I don't dislike it, but I'm never gonna run screaming to the store to buy another one. No, I probably won't buy another one of these. Although I might try a different brand. Would you chill out. Or you know, make one, or have you make one, <laughs> or have Suzanne make one. So. Okay. All right, so, all right, that's a review. Pie is good. I Thanksgiving think. continues. Yes. All right, that's a review. Very quick update. Somebody had me nuke her pie. How is it? It's good. Even softer now. And there's literally nothing that differentiates the flavor from a Texas Roadhouse sweet potato. So, let's take a look at that. Mm. I put some whipped cream on it, but it looks like a soupy mess. So no, it's not. I was it's I was the, right. The crust just cracked and flattened. Which I don't need the crust anyway, because it's bullshit. Okay, well, I still think that it should be served cold. You put That's everything it. in the in the Because everything's better cold. No. He eats yeah, cookies yeah. cookies in the fridge. They're delicious that way. No. Whatever. That's it. I was right. No. He was wrong.